So what's up, world? It's your girl, One Wing, here at Maya's Treasure Box. In the drop these next 72 hours for my cancer. So my cancer, y'all tune in, y'all lock in. Y'all y'all know I'm a character. Keep that in mind. Keep in mind, I'm a character. I'm a cancer Leo, too, so y'all know. I just like to have fun, though. Make you smile. Y'all know how that go. So let's see. First of all, y'all throat chakras are activated, so that's a good thing. Not saying that it was never activated, because y'all cancers a rip of asses. Let somebody make y'all mad. Y'all gonna cuss their ass out. Y'all gonna be playing with them, but y'all so intuitive. I don't even think half of y'all even know how intuitive that y'all are. But guess what? Selflessness, humility, you learn how to accept all of that. So you're doing a lot of things. It's, it's, it's more conscience than doing it from your ego put it like that the biggest thing here is you got to learn balance but you got this because i don't know who this person is you're dealing with but you see them look nose covered every time that nose it should be message whoever you're dealing with i'm not sure who this person could be it could be a, a a cancer it could be a scorpio or a pisces or maybe this is the way somebody's looking at you because you got the nine of cups and then you got the nine of pentacles rides so this is a wish come true a, a dream come true some of y'all could be trying to study on the occult side and trying to manifest your powers or trying to bring out the little witch inside of you there's nothing wrong with that you know what i'm saying but look you pop your own tags and your own color, so you got somebody watching you. This person right here could be a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. They go to Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries. And you work, like, some of y'all probably just got into learning about, like, the mystics of life or, or the occult or, like, trying to study, trying to figure out the difference with paganism and occultism and Gnosticism. You get, y'all get where I'm going. Y'all working on it. Y'all got this, though. Y'all could be dealing with a Virgo, but maybe it took y'all to go inside y'all self to see what's really going on because that happens, too. And whoever you was dealing with, you said, fuck that. I'm fucking sick of this bullshit. Ain't taking your shit no goddamn more. You can kick rocks. I ain't going to say the other words, y'all being nice. But anyways, so you were like, Jesus, I'm going to need your help right now, Lord. So you walked away from that situation. Guess what? High five, queens, because that's what you're supposed to do, my queens and kings. So now this person feeling like the one that thought it was the shit, they feeling like, damn, they actually left my ass alone. Hell yeah, motherfucker. Sure did. Damn sure did. You think I'm going to be in competition with a fucking peasant? And I know I'm a queen or a king. It don't work like that. We don't rock like that. So guess what? You standing in your element, right? And you at that point, you're not putting up with shit else. You're done taking all the verbal abuse that they always come at you with. You're done with that. You ain't got time for that right there. And guess what? Somebody trying to get in touch with you. Now, it's coming in real fast, real, real fast. They know you ain't playing with their asses, right? They know you are not fucking playing with them. So they trying to come. So let's see. I'm gonna play this out in the next 72 hours, right, y'all? So, after all this heartache and loss that you've been going through, and it's like, there go the camera boy, some small steps asking for help. Guess what? You protect it and you got it. Ain't no power higher than that, that one almighty. I don't know everybody how they own, who they represent, so you know, I'm not getting into that right there. But look, okay, so y'all got cars that wanna jump out, really? Let's see. So you got this Leo Sagittarius or Aries that's trying to come towards you real fast. They got something to fucking say. They got something to say. And guess what? They're going to the will of fortune. is about to turn. This is a person that you probably look out for all the time. But you started seeing through the deception and they broke your fucking heart. It could have been the Aries or maybe they just feel like they got the authority over every damn body. So you end up focusing on your damn self. Guess what? Now they don't turn into the king of ones. Fuck the knight, the king of ones. So they turn back around. They, they, getting, they getting this shit right. Somebody feel like they just stuck and stagnant because you all you got a couple of options. We know how that go. The person that's offering you this love, you got to pay a, another counsel. Or maybe this is just the way you're feeling about this person at this moment. It is what it is. Somebody from the past don't got in touch with you, though. Somebody from your past don't reached out and got in touch with you. Like, you know what I'm saying? Baby, I ain't never forget about you. You know what I'm saying? All I can do is think about you all the time. Y'all could have a child from this person. Maybe even a boy. This person shit at you in the past. So they only know how to come back. And it's like, y'all could have had a happily ever after. 
There go that high priestess. There go that goddamn Pisces right there. So, yeah, they got the initials of the letters J, B, the letter S, T, the letter O, the letter R. You got this Knight of Pentacles coming in. They want to offer you some love, too, but they just moving real slow. So, this like a Taurus, a Virgo, or either Capricorn. Somebody getting recognition. Somebody getting recognition. They feel like it's like a dream come true. And it's all about because you walked the hell away from the bullshit that was not fucking... Doing you no good. So we're going to see what the last day say, y'all. We just going to see what it freaking says. Because I'm trying to tell you, my counselors, y'all know I give y'all y'all smoking words. I don't know if I got to do it to y'all. My counselors, listen. Family's going to fuck you harder than anybody else. I know blood thickening and water, but that motherfucker leaked the same way water do. Okay? Because y'all y'all have to have that family. That's where y'all lose out on a lot of stuff. Whoever this person is you're dealing with, that's a mirror image of yourself. So you got a, you got a divine masculine because you are a divine feminine. This don't go for everybody, so keep that in mind. This could be the cross watcher, but I'm just letting you know. Yes, that's your soulmate. Yes, it's divinity. Yes, that's God. I'm talking about son. You're standing in your authority now. Only thing, <laughs> the sky is the limit. So let's finish this on out. See how we're gonna do these next 72 hours, y'all. Cause y'all know they be tripping. What y'all trying to hold on to this devil? It could be a Scorpio. Y'all trying to hold on to it. See? Sometimes you gotta let shit go that ain't meant to be held on to. That's easier said than done. I get that. So you know we're gonna skip past that right there. Y'all could be dealing with an Aries. Put it like this. Or maybe this damn Aries or whoever trying to make you that offer like Jesus. I thank you misunderstood me again, Lord. I know you don't make no mistakes, God, but I think sometimes it be accidents. Because, see, I had accident. He had accident and sent me the wrong baby daddy twice. And I know it was an accident, y'all. But anyway, like, Lord, this ain't what the fuck. This. Lord, I, don't, I can't deal with this right here. Jesus like, you know what? You getting on my damn nerves. Don't y'all take me the wrong way. I am a character. I tell the story. I narrate it. You put it together. Okay? So I go into character. So you're trying to manifest this happily ever after, you walk the hell away from that motherfucker because that motherfucker, listen, you started seeing the bullshit in their asses and you got a true offer of love. It could be a Taurus or a Gemini. Like I said, Virgo, Capricorn, or either um, a, a Taurus. Somebody getting some fame and recognition. I don't know who it is, but somebody getting something. They feel like you a dream come true, a wish come true. You pop your own tags. They probably miss you breaking bread with them. That could be what it is, but it's like this right here. You got a Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. So whoever I'm talking to, because this is not going to resonate with everybody, you got two men and you got one female after you. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, but you see through the deception, right? This news coming in so damn fast. You working on yourself. You trying to manifest because somebody from that past came back. And what had happened was whoever this person was from that past that's coming back around, see, they shitted on you. And they want to give you a half ass cup of love. You ain't had time for that shit, they had you. But, on the other hand, a celebration is coming along. Because we start to look into ourselves. We are building ourselves up. We are focusing on ourselves. Ain't no love more stronger, no better than what self-love is. I'm trying to tell you, and I ain't, I'm not comparing that to God. Because you know how some people be. But anyways... Thank y'all for tuning in. If you like the video, make sure you hit the like button, hit the subscribe, leave me a message. I reply, I respond back. I love to meet with my smart people because I get tired of, listen, I made a vow. I made my votary for this year. I said I'm not going to be dealing with people that I got to dumbify myself for any longer. Anyways, how y'all doing through this coronavirus? Um, It's going to be okay, y'all. I think this is just another mind manipulating technique for population control. The orange man gonna be back in the chair anyways. I don't know why they doing all this. Then they say gonna close down all the looks so just y'all do they know what they finna cause? Anyways, <laughs> I appreciate y'all tuning in though. Like I always said, stay tuned. Here we come. Fuck coronavirus. This is Donald the Rejects, not goddamn it.